The Recording Industry Association of America, RIAA, is a trade organization that supports and promotes the creative and financial vitality of the major music companies. Nearly 85% of all legitimate recorded music produced and sold in the United States is created, manufactured, or distributed by RIAA members. So people, there you have it. This is no pian pian recorded or manufactured labeling of uh, vibes cartel getting a gold or um, his single fever reaching the gold certification status the gold certification status was redefined back in 1976 long before many of us were born and it simply means that Vibes Cartel has sold over 500,000 units of a single called Fever. Now, I hope all of the fake producers also see what uh, that loyalty is really a lifestyle. I'm so happy and so proud of TJ Records. And to Zoja Music, who has striked me on YouTube, now I can see and understand why zoe is so meticulous and so stringent about her her usage or copyright infringements because this these are the type of things that artists needs to do to ensure that their music gets sold or their 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 artistry gets sold and get out there into the public eye across the world and can actually hit the gold and the platinum status now man I can't begin to speak as a ardent Gaza supporter. From a top to now, I can really, really say I'm very proud of Vibes Cartel. And I know I speak for the entire Fair Nation when I say I am proud of Vibes Cartel. I feel it in my toe. I feel it in my hair. Every fiber in my being means that I am extremely proud of Vibes Cartel. Why? Vibes Cartel has beat the odds. Vibes Cartel is incarcerated. Vibes Cartel is locked away. Vibes Cartel is in prison. In prison, and I'm not going to argue with anybody about he put himself there. He did not. This system incarcerated Vibes Cartel because his reach was too exponential. And not even reach is exponential. It is not every day you get up and see an artist who is educated in the genre called dancehall that has the ability to articulate themselves as if they are the prime minister of the country and in my eyes vibes cartel is the government of jamaica it may not be your government or your government but he sure is the government of fair nation gaza nation world boss nation yes he's our government and regardless of what you may think of him he is an educated he is a very influential and he is a pioneer in the field of dancehall music vibes cartel was never ever set to achieve anything else after they threw him in prison and locked him away i am pretty sure they had it mm -hmm. look a dirty boy look a bleach out face boy yes that him forget and all them followers them now them are gonna suffer and them now getting the music and this and that but look at vibes cartel now he has the final say he has the final hurrah. I am sure he wants to be out here with us, his fans, with us, his supporters, and most of all with his family and friends and children. But at the end of the day, Vibes Cartel is achieving a lot. He is achieving a lot amidst all that he has gone through. And just to see him achieving and just just, just gaining and, and, and ex he's just getting to an, a height snow where you really have to say how much greater can this man get and it goes to show and it gives credence to the fact that if you were born to be vibes cartel and somebody else tries to be vibes cartel and this is no knock at anybody but realistically no if there's only one gaza diva and there's only one vibes cartel and vibes cartel was destined to be what he is today and if someone else tried to achieve this it would be impossible no other artist nowhere anywhere in the world can say 
they were locked away. We know of many who were locked away. We know of many who were incarcerated. It takes a particular mental strength to do what Vibes Cartel has done. I don't think people understand. It takes a particular mental strength. Prison is supposed to cage you mentally and physically, not just physically. It is supposed to cripple you. And once the mind is, the mind is locked away and the mind tells the body not to perform, then that has to take effect. So if nobody has ever evaluated it, spend some time evaluating. This man is a genius. This man is naturally strong. The man is just a stalwart at what he does. To hit the billboard and come in at number 87 with an album, no expletives, no dirty words. Vibes Cartel is just an artist and he's showing people that his artistry is predicated upon what the mass likes. And he's an artist and, and, and his artistry comes in various forms. He's the most multifaceted faceted artist he can do girl song he can do male thuggish song he can do socially conscious songs so he's just mixing up things to ensure that he reaches every corner and his pockets or a subset of fan base or customers as we call it in the world of business his customers he's reaching his customers so i don't see what this political who rise about and five cartel need to step down off a pedestal and they so so what happened the whole political sphere is corrupted five cartel has stated in many interviews and we his supporters know this and there is nothing government or babylon can do to make us think otherwise that Vibes Cartel is not responsible for growing your children. And Vibes Cartel is definitely not responsible for any crime that is in Jamaica. The former government was in when he was incarcerated. The current government is in. And the crime rate has been the worst ever. Stop using Vibes Cartel as a scapegoat. This RIA. A certification only proves that Vibes Cartel is first a musician, secondly a musician, and thirdly and lastly a musician that feeds his fans what they want. As Vibes Cartel said, Gaza Nation, Fair Nation, this is my last point to you guys. As Vibes Cartel said in his number one trending song in the country, Tony Montana, how it going to look for the fear of to be in the pyramid, kicking it like mesam and warring with peasants. Vibes Cartel is the only king of dancehall. No pun intended. Fever is from the king of dancehall album. Any other king? A burger king.